Welcome back to Overlord Anime Review episode number two. This is our viewing the shorts that the first season had called Pure Purpolites. There are eight of these shorts. Before I get to these particular shorts, I want to talk about a few things I forgot to talk about from the previous one. First of which, there's one 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 of the characters appearing this one actually appeared in season one, a, a maid named Solution. She appears for a handful of episodes. Her first episode is seeing her with a per uh, a guy who's got who's very much drunk and wants a piece of her. She allows that by taking the top of her dress off and having him trying to grope her. Instead, she absorbs him through her breast. Why? Because she's made of slime. That's the reason why. Mm -hmm. Let's see what else. Oh yeah, the the butler guy. He doesn't do much of anything in this in this particular uh, throughout the first season, with the exception of the opening episode. He doesn't do much of anything at all. He does a little bit more as time goes on. Mm -hmm. Yep. Let's see. Mm, trying to think though. Albedo, I pretty much covered everything for her that I could think of that she was pretty much doing. Oh yeah, they also mentioned that uh, there was a line that in here that it's. It is from the light novels where he says he loves he loves everybody, and they probably close that beetle trying things. Yeah, like like confessing that he loves her and everybody else's. He even goes over the top. Also, they do cut a line in here when they have Sasabia go into Oz's office now in the manga and in the in the light novel. It says one of the reasons why I came to see you because I want to see your brand new office. Here, in the anime, they don't make a comment about his office at all. That she has his brain spanking new office. Yeah, I don't know why they cut that line from the from the anime. It's particularly very bizarre. I do not know if it's in there for the sub for this particular season. Because I have I never watched the sub anyways. I don't know if it's there or not. But here, it's just, she's off a mission and that's it. Mm -hmm. What else? Um, Let me think here. Hmm. The fight between Alta, uh, Sheltair and Oz, it's a pretty good fight. It takes up a good two episodes, which is fine. And it plays out pretty much the same, pretty much mostly the same way as it does both in the manga and the light novel. Not really much change here. Except felt like it was a bit rushed and, yeah. But it's still an okay depiction of the, of the actual fight between them. Like, I would say of the fights that basically that the main character gets involved in, in the case of the second book, it's pretty accurate to how it's depicted. And as far as I can tell, there's no really change except the cut down the description, which I thought was really nice. Yep. That's really it for basically that. The pure purpoletti thing is kind of one of these QB type of things, where it's, except they're kind of like normal size, but a little bit shorter. And the story for these particular eight shorts is that Oz gets his hands on these, uh, this device called Total Maniac, accidentally uses himself, and he, and he basically sort of overreacts to everything. Like, he's basically reacting, all of a sudden, Albedo basically comes to see him. Albedo herself, out of these eight shorts, she's in pretty much all of them, except for the third and fourth one. Yeah, she's nowhere to be seen at all. The maids, on the other hand, who are actually kind of the stars of these particular shorts, they're in pretty much most of these shorts, they, they they first appear, show up in the shorts in episode two, and they they appear in like seven of the shorts. Oz is probably the only one who actually show up for all eight shorts. Mm -hmm. Yeah, various they, they they do various things in here, like getting solution of the back of stuff that goes on there, trying out a particular movie, doing this. Yeah. Like they say, is a lie that because on casting, you never realize nothing. <sighs> Excuse me. Yes. It's a pretty good set of shorts. N nothing really bad about these shorts, it's just that they're just pure fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I would probably say, out of the characters introduced from these early stuff, I would say Albito is definitely my favorite m female main character. Oz, obviously, favorite male character because the guy's a badass. Yeah. I even love the fact he actually flies up he actually flies up near the moon and gets kind of a good view of the of the, of the world that they're on. Mm-hmm. 
yeah. Not much else to say about these shorts except they're just they're just good. There's there's a few that are really weird, like what happened with Solution, where she just eats a couple guys and gets puts on weight. There's also the final one as well. Uh, C two, who is the gunner, she just they have also they have an episode in here where they kind of modify her because she's a freaking robot. Okay, fine. Also, I should point out though that in the anime, that the characters actually talk in terms of the RPG stuff like HP. HP, uh, MP, like various other stuff, like experience stuff. They do cut out a lot, a little mini scene from, I believe it was the third novel, where Oz asks Albedo what her experience is, and her face turns red. In the anime, of course, the question is about her combat experience. This is, of course, prior to him going out and facing up against Shelter here. Of course, this is also within the mausoleum. And... It's particularly a very good scene, and I do appreciate the fact that they kept the scene in. I didn't like the fact that they cut out that little moment that was really that could have been really nice to see Albedo basically seeing her face go red. Mm hmm Yeah. But not much else to say about the the shorts themselves. The anime is fantastic. And so in my next part I'm gonna talk about the first three OVAs released. There have been four. The fourth one I will talk about after I finish up watching the third season of the show. Mm -hmm. So here's the first videos are going to go. Is that part three, episode three is going to talk about the first three shorts. The fourth the 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 fourth part, the fourth episode, is going to be talking about the two compilation films and my thoughts on them. The fifth part is going to be on the second season. Six is going to be on its shorts. Seven is going to be on the third season of the show, A is going to be on its shorts, and 9 is going to be on the last OVA released. So yeah, about 9 videos overall, okay? But until I see you in the next video, bye.